for years, the paparazzi followed Janice Dickinson, capturing pics of her dating rock stars Mick Jagger, Ronnie Wood, both of the same band, the Rolling Stones. But this time around, Janice wants to be the rock star. Okay, let's get into this because you're, you've hung around, as I said, a few rock stars. I have. You've seen them. Were, did they know you could sing? Did, did Mick know you could sing? Well, I think he always told me to be quiet because I was so loud. I was such a big, <laughs> I was so loud. I was such a big fan, always just rocking and rolling. Right. You know, I know all the lyrics to the songs. So, it, you know. But this, when did just, this emerge from you? This emerged about a year and a half ago. So that, oh, wow, that recent. Yes, Ricky Stokes, uh, my producer. Yeah, the music producer yes, you work with. He gave me a phone call. I met him in Minneapolis. And that's Ricky. Yeah. And he is lovely. And he had me work it out. Uh, you sure are like, holding on tight. Is this just professional? <laughs> I mean, you're a beautiful woman, and there he is. He's smiling. Little Ricky. Little Ricky. <laughs> but you were in the recording studio together. He had me dancing in rehearsal halls. Wow. He had me uh, rehearsing this song daily. This is you in the in the studio in the audio booth. Yes. So, I mean, you, you have really done the... This is not a flight of fancy. You're no. putting in the work. Yes, I am. It's been about a year now. We have about... Uh, three songs to go on the LP. You, oh, I love that, I love it. So, you, you have, you took voice lessons to find, you took voice lessons to find the right pitch. Yes. Are you, are, do you have a natural singing, some people have that natural singing no. voice. No. No, I do not. You do not, <laughs> I love your honesty. But you say it's kind of a Katy Perry vibe. Well, yeah, I admire Katy Perry, I admire Miley Cyrus. Yeah. I admire. I like that. I like Wait, that. Let it go. I love Aretha Franklin. Of course. Yeah. Come on. I love it. So, when, when you sing, when we, you were you in the shower singing? Shower. You're like, I can do Car. this. Yeah. You know, kitchen sink. <laughs> uh, walking the dog. Walking the dog. You wrote multiple songs. Yes. And the one you're performing for us, I coined it. I coined it. It's a kind of a love letter to you coining the phrase supermodel. That is correct. Yeah. And a lot of people don't realize you, you came up with the title. I coined the title back in 1982. I was working night and day. I was on the cover of every magazine in the world. Oh. I was... Oh. Yeah. It was hard work like your show. Yeah. It, it, you know, you have to, like, re rehearse. Yeah. Uh, you know, do the walk, do the makeup, get get the poses correct, uh, listening, listening, not talking over someone who's asking me questions. Yeah. It was uh, my agent called me on the phone. She says, "Who do you think you are, Superman?" She was French, and I said, "No, honey, I'm supermodel." I love it. I love it. I love it. So I said, "Your first song was I." Coined it. That's true. You, and you're performing for us today. Yes. Get, what's the song? Get into it. Get into it. Do you, I said this show was show me what you got. Are you, because you don't strike me as a person who's ever nervous. Oh, I'm, I, I take it and I breathe through it. Really? Uh, I, I sit here with you today having been a fan of yours. Oh, thank you. And, thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you. And being a fan of yours and just watching newscasters and watching people hold their composure in front of people. Well, is... I love that you were studying newscasters. Why didn't you go over to CNN instead of singing? <laughs> you could have... Too much? Nah. <laughs> nah. I, I don't think Anderson Cooper can teach me anything. <laughs> Sorry. I love it. So this, this singing voice, this, this performance, everyone says it's vibrant. I've heard the music. I haven't had a chance like our audience right now. We're going to see you perform on our stage. Okay, now wait. <laughs> because it, it's a, what you want is, and I should say, you want a dance party vibe. Your thing yes. is about the dance party. Yes, it's always, I started out at gay bars, and they are fun to, they are fun to go to. And... <laughs> I love it. Yes. And, I, you know, my gays just love me and they supported me, so I started... <laughs> I, love I love it. So this was at Pride. Pride. You performed on stage, rocked it out. So it's, it's a whole vibe. It's a party. It is. Me in the same pants, my God. It's just... <laughs> I am others. <laughs> and I understand you might be doing a little country music as well. That's next. That's next. Yeah. Okay. So 
Beyonce has Cowboy Carter. You're gonna get oh. your country music back. I don't love the use her name in my in the same sentence. Oh, she is a queen. Yes, she is. She's yes, a queen. Well, listen. Beyonce is a queen, but guess what? You are a super model. That's, that's true.